Hello, Mission family. My name is Chris Coe, and I'm here with my good friend, Brandon Lang. And uh, we're gonna give you here a lead pastor update. We both serve on the Board of Servant Leaders. And uh, first of all, we wanna thank you so much for the prayers and for the encouragement that you provided to us. We're incredibly grateful, and it really does help. Second thing, I really wanna thank you so much for the surveys that you filled out. The insights and the suggestions were completely in line with the vision and direction where mission is heading, and that is incredibly encouraging to us. So, where do we stand on the Lead Pastor Update? Well, at this point in time, we're in stage three of five of the, the process. Now, stage three looks like having input from a lot of different people involved in the, the volunteers and other ministries that help give us insight and feedback into some of the candidates. I hope you understand and know that we've spent hours and hours as a board of servant leaders reviewing these and interviewing and going through the process. And we're very excited because we've got to, to be able to uh, be, connect with as well as learn from a lot of different pastors and candidates from all across the country. Now, I have this caveat. During the November and December timeframe, unfortunately, a lot of these lead pastors or pastors are heavily involved with their church and the process over Christmas time and Thanksgiving and the holidays. So bear with us as we probably won't be able to give you an update until January or February timeframe. All that to be said, I know that you've uh, many of you have asked about Steve Carter. And so I'm gonna hand that over to Brandon as he's gonna give you some insight on Steve Carter. Yeah, thanks, Chris. So. Thank you, Mission, for reaching out and asking about Steve Carter. We we love Steve Carter, and we are so thankful that he is very engaged in Mission Community Church, and he loves Mission. Right now, Steve feels like, after we've had conversations with him, that he feels that God is, has him exactly where God wants him to be. And so Steve will continue to be part of our teaching team, and we will see him for months, months ahead. And we are very excited for his commitment to mission and to see the success into the future. Lastly, I want to close with saying thank you so much, Mission, for pouring into our church as a whole. We have seen great things. We have seen so much involvement, engagement from you, and we are so thankful. Our, our finances are strong right now, and we are in a very healthy position. We are extremely excited to see the future ahead. It, it, it's very bright, and we are very excited to see what God's gonna do. So thank you so much, Mission. Go out and be the church that God has called you where you live, work, and play.